You're a joke, man. You're a joke. You need to watch a YouTube video or something. Hold him, put him back in the video. You're ridiculous. Excuse me? Hold him. He's Hold under him. arrest. Oh, yeah, man. Right. You can watch a video, man. What are your men assaulted him? Assaulted him. Uh, the court considers your conduct the using profanity, telling the court to uh, get a life, etc., calling the court a joke, uh, in the case that that's consummatious behavior. It appears it's an immediate and direct interference with the proper administration of justice and the court sends you to 60 days in the House of Corrections. Stand for me. Okay, I'm talking, I'm talking, I'm talking, and uh, come on in. Eat some ass. I'm Adam. I am. <laughs> That's me. Me and my good bud, Adam Miller, or as he now goes by, Ademo. Ademo is a son, brother, uncle, and friend of many. He loves playing poker, his style is tight aggressive, and he loves his dog, Skyler. We first crossed paths a couple of years ago when he joined the Motorhome Diaries. Thanks to his hard work ethic and good nature, he helped make that project the success that it was. And thanks to him being awesome, we became really good friends. What's up, potty people? I'm Dave Pete's in the house. Not long after getting off the road, he found a coplock.org, a pro police accountability site. I joined him soon afterwards, and since then, an all-star team of writers, researchers, and podcasters have joined the Coplock family. And last year, we hit the road again with Liberty on Tour. Hey, I'm Pete Air. And I'm Adam Miller. <laughs> Though this time, we sought to advance the Volunteer Society. As many of the folks we've interacted with would probably say, Adamo is a great guy. He has a good heart and is making a positive impact, and he's someone I'm proud to call my friend. Well, policy is take your hat off. Yeah. Whose policy is that? That's the court's policy. You want to go out? Sir, we're going to Sir, that's my problem. Get out of here. Get out. Get out. Get up and get out. You're under arrest. Hey, man, what are you guys doing? Under arrest. You got it. I was trying to sit down. I was not being disrespectful. And this is what you guys do to me because I want to get out my hat on. What are you guys doing, man? Now you're choking me with my hoodie, man. That's not cool. Now they're hurting him again. Now they're hurting him again. Come on, guys. I mean, turn around, dude. Look what they're doing to him. Look at this shit, man. Come on, dude. You think that's all right? So how do you want to do it? I mean, I have a motion here. Uh, to, to film the proceedings that uh, listed a uh, name Pete Ayer. Is that your name? E Y R E? Pardon me? All right, well, do you, want to, do you want to follow through and, and provide the other information? You can, you can get released if you do. I'm not going to release you unless you do. Let's put it that way. Do you have a moment to, for me to explain some things from my stance no. before I uh, proceed? No. The, the only question is, are you, the, only, the only question is, are you going to identify yourself and provide and, and, and get processed in a normal fashion? Uh, number one, number two, are you going to apply for counsel to be appointed to represent you? Uh, and that's pretty much all we're going to do after we set the bail conditions. It's up, it's up to you. You can stay there if you, if you want, or you can you get out. Can joke, man. You can kiss my fucking ass. Right. You're a piece of shit. Hold him. Hold He's him. under arrest. Oh, yeah, man. Right. You can watch a video, man. Let him out of it. Get, get him out of it. Fucking loser. Sir, with all respect, I feel like I was evicted yesterday. You're a joke, man. You're a joke. You need to watch a YouTube video or something. I'll, I'll put him back You're in the You're ridiculous. Excuse me? Put him in the other room. Mind this way, sir. I'm sick of you guys. Watch. All of you. you. Just watch a video, man. What are your men assaulted him? Assaulted him!
No name? Actually, sir, I did not ask his name. Well, let's talk about that. What's your name? It is Adam. All right, well, you're here because uh, the conduct that you displayed a few minutes ago in front of the court, in open court, uh, constitutes uh, contempt. You have a right to, uh, it's called a right of allocution. That is, you have a right to speak for yourself before I pass sentence. Would you like to exercise that right? Uh, sure, I don't understand how uh, hurting somebody's feelings is a crime. I mean, I apologize that my words offended you, but I, I uh, Not me personally, it's the court. It's the proper in, in, uh, administration of justice in the courtroom that we're talking about here. Well, the court considers your conduct, they're using profanity, telling the court to uh, get a life, etc., calling the court a joke, uh, in the case that that's contumacious behavior, interferes, it's an immediate and direct interference with the proper administration of justice, and the court sends you to 60 days in the House of Corrections. Stand for um, I love I, you, Adam. Can I, you guys have to stop doing this. What are you doing? Why do you keep doing this to people? He hasn't done anything wrong. I'm not eating or anything anymore. No, this is fucked up. I'm sorry. I'm not going to stand here and let you walk away with me. No, this is wrong. Why are you doing this? No. Go to coplock.org slash free a demo to find out how you can help him. Find, share, and utilize media contacts so we can win in the court of public opinion. Print and send a free a demo postcard or write him a letter. He loves hearing from people on the outside. It really keeps him going. Send letters to Judge Burke through the Love Burke to Liberty program. Donate to the Liberty Activism Fund. Help coplock.org's Brett Perry get to Keene. The more folks on the ground, the, the better representation we're going to be able to get for a demo. We made a wish list on Amazon for a demo for books that he may want to read when he's locked up. If you're able, check him out and send him one. Help spread the free a demo meme and introduce those in your sphere to the injustice happening in Keene by making your Facebook profile picture the free a demo picture. Join the candlelight vigil Monday, January 31st at 5 to 6 opposite the Cheshire County Jail on Route 101, just east of Keene. And since you're there, you may as well visit a demo. Do you advocate that a demo work through the system to get justice? Then connect with his mom. She's collaborating with others to pursue potential lawsuits, motions, etc. And be creative. If you have your own idea on, on what you can do to help a demo and get the word out there, do it. Run with it. Decentralization is our strength and everything you can do is appreciated. I've learned a lot from a demo. He's a good person and he certainly doesn't deserve the treatment he suffered at the hands of those who purport to work for him. Join me and a lot of other individuals in demanding that he be released immediately and that we both get accountability from the criminals who violated our rights. If we don't stand up today for what we know is right, it'll only be more difficult tomorrow. Again, go to coplock.org slash free demo for more. I do want to brass my balls. Yeah. Then we can, we can uh, bra brass them and give them to Barsky to give to somebody. Is that it? I believe so.